I don't believe in God. I don't believe in a creator. I believe that when we die, we go to sleep. And I don't believe in any religion. That's exactly what I thought growing up as a young boy in the city of London. So, as I said, I was born in London. I didn't believe in anything growing up. Nothing at all. 16 years old, I was at a party with my friend Simon. Simon said to me after he'd been drinking a bit, Simon, a Christian friend, said, Don't you think, why are we here? Why have we been created? Just to be like our parents, make money, do business, die, and that's it? There's nothing else? There has to be a reason we're here. Why are we here? I said, Simon, be quiet. This is not something I want to think about. We're at a party. But that question stayed in my mind. Well, here, the back of my mind. And from time to time, I would try to find the answer to that question. I remember I went to the library to do my homework and I, I found many books about religion. And I started to look for the answers in those books. I looked at the books of the Christians, the Jews, the Hindus, the Buddhists, everybody. I didn't find anything for me that gave me the answer to the question, why are we here? Why are we alive? Now, in that library, for, for whatever reason, there was not a single book about Islam. There was nothing at all. So by about 17 years old, I kind of gave up on that um, question or finding the answer. One day, I uh, heard some people talking about a place in London, Hyde Park. There's a place called Speaker's Corner where you can go and listen to people talk about their religion. I went there. I was about 17 and a half, I think. And I would listen to a Muslim speaking about the Qur'an, the miracles of the Qur'an, speaking about the purpose of our, of our creation. I listened to him every Sunday for about six months. After six months, I, had, I hadn't spoken to him until then. After six months, I went up to him, I said, please, I want to be a Muslim. Not now, in the future. He said, you want to be a Muslim? I said, I think so, but I need information. He said, let's sit down together. We sat down, we talked for about two hours. He answered all of my questions. He said to me, do you believe what, what, what I've told you today? I said, yeah, I believe it. He said, do you believe it in your heart? I said, 100%. He said, then say it with your tongue. I said, sure, why not? So I said, Ashhadu an la ilaha illallah wa ashhadu anna Muhammadan abduhu wa rasuluh. He said, today you've become a Muslim. 